and it was really cringy because I just discovered vegetarianism and that oh my god we're killing all of these animals and I did photo shoots where I would cover myself in blood and I had all of these I would do public talks and I would do all now I am by no means bashing vocalizing veganism and spreading Mm -hmm. the word about veganism however I was very much if you do this you're a shitty person which is not a good way to be do you think do you think that a lot of people start up that way if you're going to be vegan by choice Okay, because there are other vegans, vegans who have to be because of health. Like Kevin Smith, you know, Jay and Silent Bob, that director, he had a massive heart attack, so became vegan to keep himself alive. Mm -hmm. Okay, that kind of thing, you know, is fine. Do you think, and I've seen a lot of people do this who I know who've gone vegan, by a lot, actually, I've seen three people do it. (laughs) Let's quantify that. So what they've done is they've gone um, from meat eater to vegan Mm. by choice and then told the rest of the world that they're shitheads for not being it. And then they've gone, oh, hold on a minute, because they found their level. Right. Do you think there's some insecurity of, about being veganism or do you feel that you have to be militant? Do you know what beginning? I think it is? I, mean, I can only speak from personal experience. Mm-hmm. I think for me, especially, I mean, the transition into vegetarianism, I was quite young and I was sort of, I think you're very passionate about everything when you're a teenager, mm-hmm. like everything is so much bigger. And I'm not trivialising the issue, but I found the the things that I found out to be so shocking and the fact that people were going along with this in my opinion industrialized normalized torture was so shocking to me that mm. I felt that I had to spread the word about this and I had to be you know I had to shock people and I had to sort of shout my opinions from the rooftops and as time's gone on the the it hasn't become an issue that's less important to me however what it is is that I'm now familiar with the practices that we we use in the UK to to obtain animal products and I'm still not comfortable with them for me personally however I think it's more important now to educate people to just tell people my opinion Mm -hmm. rather than trying to shove it down their throats because I think in answer to your question maybe people are so to use the word militant when they first turn vegan because they're shocked you know they're surprised because it's all new information to them and they think everybody's got to know about this you know everyone's got to know how terrible this is 